So, today we're going to start a long project of slandering every FGO servant in one sentence. Starting with... You were created as a fetish and it reflects in your personality. You are a punishment rather than a prize. Nobody would like you if you weren't drawn by Wada Arco. If it weren't for the overabundance of bottoms in this fan base, no one would care about you. You mistook a different woman for your wife for almost seven years and only now remember. You got backstabbed by the writers making you out to be a sleazy businessman. Nobody really cares about Extella lore. You're the servant no one knows anything about, and those that do wish they didn't. You blackmailed the crown in life, but now serve as their loyal dog. You're a gag character to a gag character. For someone whose legend is based on getting laid, you get less action than Caesar. I love you, but shut up about your dad. Your defining characteristic is an ass window. One of the most powerful beings in the Nasuverse and can't even loop. I would love one time in the story where you're not literally dead weight until the very end. Not even your kids like you. I'd say you have the personality of a stone, but at least mountains are nice to look at. If only the round table took you as seriously as they took advantage of you. Not even pedophiles in the fanbase want to see you without a shirt on. People hate you for being a force support, but tend to forget the fact that you are not allowed near schools. You are somehow more boring than Artoria. You openly admit to being a Tamamo ripoff, and it very much shows. Everyone cares more about the maniacal old man and the robot who adopted you rather than you. For being one of the most powerful swordsmen in Japan, it's amazing that your skills all have such shit uptime. You need your wife around to be interesting, and even then she carries the whole exchange. How did taking off your clothes make you less attractive? You exist. If being hot is a noble phantasm, then at least 100 other servants have a higher ranked one. You were modeled after someone from England. You were modeled after someone from France. You would let Medea shag Heracles and would like it. People care more about predicting future foreigners off of your outfit than you as a character. It must suck being the most popular and most hated character at the exact same time. I would rather shave my knuckle hair than talk to either of you pieces of parchment. If your historical counterpart saw how you act, she would commit seppuku. The main reason most people know you is because of a cooler swordsman. Nothing I can say to you would be worse than what the barber did. Most people use your egg form and you know exactly why. Who on earth asked for a boxer for Christmas? You're just Shiro. Would anyone care if you didn't have big boobs? Proof that not everyone should have kids. People don't even know your names and they just call you Pokemon. You run the dollar store version of the round table. You should have stayed as an NPC. 